Good afternoon and thank you for joining us. We are here to conduct the Sport Pesa Midweek Jackpot Draw. This follows the postponement of three games, namely game number seven, Eastleigh versus Macclesfield, game number nine, Gillingham versus AFC Wimbledon, and game number 10, Oxford United versus Bradford City. All this due to frozen pitches. The amount at stake is 32,344,798. Now, because of the three postponed games, we have 27 possible outcomes. We couldn't possibly bring all of them into the studio. But of course, I have the lady and the gentleman who will help me to go through this one. Let me introduce them again. Rachel Siengo from the Betting Control and Licensing Board. How are you today, Rachel? I'm fine. Looking very hot in red. Is it going to be a hot day today? It will be. Oh, brilliant. And you know, you're also rubbing off on Alan Thigo. He's also looking hot. <laughs> Never mind the fact that he's not in red today but are you gonna be ready to dribble through this today very much ready you will be ready dribbling a cabisa. brilliant let me yes. explain to you how it's gonna be going today there are three possible outcomes in this draw there is one that will denote a win for the home team and there is X that denotes a draw and two that denotes a win for the away team let me repeat it again one is a win for the home team X is a draw and two is a win for the away team. Are we ready to do the draw? Because we will now conduct the draw to pick the outcome for the first match. That's game number seven, Isley versus Macclesfield. Rachel, please put the balls back and into the ball. And let's get Alan to do the dribbling that he did for Arambe Stars and he did for Gormaya as well. Make sure it's very tightly shut just so that uh, he doesn't fall off while Alan is dribbling through it. I know he bust very many balls when he was really dribbling them in. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's brilliant. We are in there. Are you ready, Alan? Re so you've got the ready. defense, you've got the ball in the middle, and you're supposed to dribble. Correct. The whistle is on. Let's dribble this one. It's for the first uh, draw. That's for the game number seven, Isley versus Macclesfield. Keep dribbling, keep dribbling, keep dribbling. I'm move them passing, around, I'm shuffle passing, them, move them around. Almost, there you are, juggling them around. I'm it's Alan shooting. Figo, remember? He's done this before for Arambe Stars and for Gormaya. Well done. Give us uh, one that will give us the possible outcome of Isley versus Macclesfield. One is a win for the home team. X is a draw. Two is a win for the uh, away team. Here we are. That's the result we've got for the first game. Macclesfield, Isley versus Macclesfield is an X. So a draw is the outcome for that one. Give it back to Rachel. Rachel, please show us both the cover. There it is. Lock it again before we do anything else. So an X is what we've got in the first draw. It's locked, put in there, and Alan Thigo will do it again. So let's now conduct the second draw to pick the possible outcome. The game is number nine, Gillingham versus AFC Wimbledon. Are you ready? I'm ready. Could you possibly dribble through two teams in a dribble. day? I want you want to try that? By then I pulled it, but now I'll try. <laughs> so he's going through it again. He's got to dribble it. Move it around, move it around, shuffle it faster, faster, faster. Let's go, let's go and move it around. Brilliant. Now give us the possible outcome for Gillingham versus AFC Wimbledon. That's the other match that was postponed. Show it to Rachel. Rachel, you've seen it. There we are. Another X. That means another draw would have been the possible outcome for Gillingham versus AFC Wimbledon. Well, a day of draws then. Rachel, show us both to make sure that they are clear. Brilliant. All right. This is moving very fast, isn't it? Two draws we already got. In one tough day. Matches, tough, tough, matches. Match, tough matches. Tough <laughs> matches. Tough matches. Tough yeah. matches. Okay, are we ready to do the last one? Yes, we are. Finally, let's do the draw to pick the possible outcome for game number 10. Oxford United versus Bradford City. Dribbler. Ready. Alan Thigo. Yeah. Let's go through the defense. There are a couple of wingers as well that you've got to go through. They're moving faster, so you've got to move even faster. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Now, give us the possible outcome. Oxford United versus Bradford City. What will it be? That's the third one that we are drawing today. Showed it. We've got a win for the home team. One is a win for the home team. Amazing. Three very interesting results. We are awaiting official communication, of course, from Sport Pesa on whether we have a jackpot or whether we don't have a jackpot. It will be coming to us in a few minutes. You know, you can always check as well whether there's bonuses to be paid on the, the Sport Pesa media and the social, uh, social media and uh, Twitter handles as well. But that was a really hard game, wasn't it? Ah, very hard. Three matches in a day. Uh, a lot of but you, you played tournaments before, didn't you? But time matters. Time matters. By then well. it was 15 15, but this one is 90 minutes. You can't go with three matches in a 90 day. 90 minutes, you cannot go. I am yeah. getting communication now from Sport Pesa, the official communication from Sport 
Professor says that we do not have a jackpot. So that means we'll have a new midweek jackpot and the amount is Kenya shillings 35 million 603 331. Well, I guess that's it. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, for helping us with this. Asante sana. And thank you very much. This concludes the draw. Bonuses for the respective amounts will be displayed shortly on SportPesa social media handles. That's Facebook, SportPesa, and Twitter, at SportPesa, and tomorrow's dailies. Remember, always play responsibly.